video cast number 96, Acronyms. I've been involved with the scouting program for quite a while, and every so often something new comes up that really makes you think. On a Facebook scouting message board, a new visitor was complaining about everyone's use of acronyms as they referred to different programs and parts. An acronym, for those that don't know, is a set of letters that abbreviate a longer set of words, like USA for United States of America, or in this case, BSA for Boy Scouts of America. This really threw me for a loop, as what I do for a living is consult, comment, and improve the user experience, and this is one of the things we generally attack first, as it's known as a barrier to understanding. This all brings me to a fun Scoutmaster Dave to showcase some of the more common acronyms. Pass it along to someone new to the program, and I'm sure they'll appreciate it. Starting with some Cub Scout ones you have. CS, that's Cub Scout or Cub Scouts. More commonly, they're referred to as Cubs or more generically Scouts. The most common spoken acronym in Cub Scouts, however, has to be AOL, or Arrow of Light, which is the highest rank in Cub Scouts. Earning Arrow of Light lets a Cub transition to Boy Scouts at 10 and a half years old. You also get some less common ones in Cubs, like DL, that's Den Leader, and WDL, which is Weeblos Den Leader. Weeblos is actually an acronym by itself that's treated as a real word. Weeblows is We Be Loyal Scouts. Weeblows is not a dictionary word for some mythical creature. Boy Scouts is also fraught with acronyms, including BS for Boy Scouts, SM for Scoutmaster, ASM for Assistant Scoutmaster, and CO for Chartered Organization. Most often you'll see these written for shorthand. There is also CC for Committee Chair, MB for Merit Badge. A merit badges are awarded to Boy Scouts based on activities within the area of study by completing a list of requirements. One of the ones more commonly spoken is SPL, which is Senior Patrol Leader. This is the boy that's been tasked to lead the troop. Or PL, which is Patrol Leader, the boy that leads a group of boys called a patrol. A troop is made up of one or more patrols. JASM is Junior Assistant Scoutmaster. QM is Quartermaster. That's the guy that handles the gear. OA is also a commonly spoken one, which refers to the Order of the Arrow, which is an honor society within the Boy Scouts program. You also have BOR, or Board of Review, and less common, EBOR, which is Eagle Board of Review. These boards of review is part of the advancement process in Boy Scouts. In the training realm, there's a lot of them. The most common in order that Scouts take them are Introduction to Leadership Skills for Troops, ILST, National Youth Leadership Training, NYLT, and National Advanced Youth Leadership Experiences, which is N-A-Y-L-E. There were also some general scouting ones like GTA, or Guide to Advancement, which is a Boy Scout publication on advancement within the program, and G2SS, another publication called the Guide to Safe Scouting. Sometimes this is called GTSS. At a district level, you'll sometimes see DAC, which is District Advancement Committee, DAM, which is the District Award of Merit, RT, which is Roundtable. DE is a common one for your district executive. He's your go-to guy at council. SE is the scout executive. That's his boss. WB is Wood Badge, which is an adult advanced training program. Rounding out the list, we have YPT, which is youth protection training. JOTA, which is jamboree on the air, a ham radio thing. And Blue Basic Adult Leader Outdoor Orientation. I'll end with this common one used in signatures, YIS, or yours in scouting. Take what you like, leave the rest as we say in Woodbadge, feedback is a gift. 
Leave yours below in the comments with all the hope we can learn together. I'm Scoutmaster Dave, and this was all about acronyms. <laughs>